Upon opening the Blueprint AV software, you will see this base screen. Go to the menu dropdown and select Design. From the Tools dropdown, select 2D Full View and define what scale you will work with, metric or imperial. For this tutorial, we'll be using metric. In the Room Data tab, select the Floor sub-tab and create a new floor by clicking the plus symbol. First, name your floor. You can then choose the color the surfaces within this floor will be displayed as, as well as the height of the audience. You can also choose whether this floor will be activated, which allows its use in a simulation. Once your floor is created, you can add surfaces to it by pressing the plus symbol beside surface. From here, you can choose your surface type, enable your mirror and center functions, choose your audience height, and activate your specific surface. The manual coordinate entry fields allow you to define the size and shape of your surface. Our surface will be 40 meters long, so input 40 into the x-axis field for V3. Create a second surface, open your first surface, and copy the information you had previously input. Open your second surface, and paste the information you've just copied into the x-axis for V0. Entering 70 into the x-axis field and 8 into the z-axis field of V3 will create an inclined extension to your flat floor surface. The next installment in the Blueprint tutorial series will show you how to set up the same room using the on-site 2D calculator tool.